So I'll address the biggest elephant in every room right now. So what happens is after the advent of machine learning, deep learning and computer vision, right? So these three technologies has taken over the world. Hi, so my name is Pranjal. I am from School of Computer Science and Engineering, assistant professor in Cognitive Computing Domain. Talking about machine learning, these algorithms are actually not very new, right? All the algorithms were existing way before, right? It's just the fact that we didn't have the enough compute power. So now you must have noticed why NVIDIA and all these chip making companies, these are skyrocketing in their stocks because these guys are providing us the compute power so as to process these algorithms. Next, if we come to deep learning, so that brings the powerhouse, right? Why? Because these algorithms are developed on the basis of how actually our brain works, right? So that's why we have multiple layers and that's why the name is deep learning. So now the advantage is we can process vast amount of data. So computer vision is actually the ability of computers to basically see the world. Once we are able to see the world, we can monitor the world. Biggest industry who's taking the leverage of these technology is your raw disease prediction. You can monitor the uh, condition of the crop on the top. So these kind of technologies are working in human favor.